Hey guys and welcome back to Snacks and Sneakers. Today I've got an awesome video for you. It's going to be an unboxing, so let's get into it. So, here are the sneakers. I actually received these sneakers a couple days ago. They came in the mail. I haven't unboxed them. I've been waiting for me to unbox them on camera for you guys to see them as well. But before I do that, just a big shout out to my friend, Franz. He's always looking out for me. He's always telling me where the good sneaker deals are. You know, he's always, he's basically like my plug. He's basically like a sneaker plug. So hey, big shout out to my mate Franz. Thanks for hooking me up with these ones. These are a pair of sneakers that I've been wanting for ages. They first released um, around Air Max Day this year. So it was around I think, March. And I was like, damn, I can't believe I missed out on these. I lined up for them. I tried to go on um, Nike.com. I lucked out there, I wanted to get him on resale, but the resale price was like $350, upwards of that, and I didn't want to pay that much for him. Luckily, they just re-released recently, and the price just plummeted down. So without further ado, I will show you the shoes. The guy I got these shoes off, he went ham with the sticky tape. Two hours later. Oh, it's a struggle. And the box is gonna come out now. Oh. So as you see, it's a bright orange box, which, which means that a bright orange box is Nike. But it's not like a normal Nike box. As you see, they, it is an anniversary box, which marks the 30th anniversary of a certain shoe. Now, let's see what shoe that is. You can see that, that is awesome. That is like an awesome touch. Air Max 1 anniversary. So now you know it's an Air Max 1, but what colorway is it? On March 26, 1987, something more than a shoe was born. The Air Max 1 was like nothing we'd ever seen before. Visible Air started a revolution. I, I read like a four year old, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. So sorry guys, if you think that I read too slow, I pretty much read like a four year old. Over the next 30 years, it captured the imagination of dreamers and pushed the boundaries of what was possible. In 2017, that spirit is still alive. Join us as we celebrate the milestone and look forward to pushing boundaries for the next 30 years. Woo! Woo! Here they are. These are the Air Max 1s in the Royal Blue Anniversary colorway. These shoes are incredible. They're amazing. They're fresh. As you heard by me reading that thing on the box before, that these shoes released 30 years ago. Now the original colorway is the red and white with the gray colorway. So like I was saying, these shoes released 30 years ago. And for the silhouette to still be so popular today, and for it to mean so much to sneakerheads around the world, it just speaks volumes about Nike as a company, and it speaks volumes about the silhouette. Air Maxes have been around for that long, and they're still selling out. Look at the Vapor Max. Look at the Air Max 1s that released. One of the most sought after shoes of the year was the Air Max 1, which was the Atmos Air Max 1s that released. You're looking at a shoe that is still popular today, it pops, you know, when you see it, you just think, whoa, you know? The hits of royal around the shoe, which is the royal blue, just, it just makes the shoe look amazing. You know, you feel the materials, and the materials just feel premium. You know, it feels like a nice suede on the grey bits. You got the mesh, that feels nice. You got the white laces, I think they do come with other laces. Let me have a look. They do, they do come with other laces. Look at that, I didn't even notice that. It comes with a, what, do you, what would you call this? A tag? It comes with a tag. If you can't see the laces, the laces are kind of like white, but they have like a silvery tinge to them. But they do come with the plain white laces in case you want a lace swap. For them to just make this shoe so close to the OG style and the OG color, it's just nice. Of course, like every Air Max has you know, that visible air unit. You have know, the OG Nike Air on the back, on the heel which is an awesome touch. So they retailed for 200. I bought them for 250, but I got them shipped for free. 
So I'm pretty much paid like 230. But that's not bad considering they're going for 350 at a stage. Please, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button, subscribe to Snacks and Sneakers, and I'll see you guys very, very soon with a new video.